Hello and welcome back to our Galactic Ruler Let's Play Poorly. When last we were here, we were uh, just starting to get the exploitation of this asteroid out here. We had just dropped off uh, a new spaceport down in Izuno. We've got these interceptors are going to do some intercepting, I guess. Uh, we've pretty much explored the entire system except for this one spot here in Uterra, which is pirates. So we're going to have to deal with them at some point. But I don't want to deal with them right now. Right now, what I want to do is I think I want to build some more planetary engineers so we can start getting some guys out here. Uh, we are currently building another interceptor. Again, that's the that's the AI. That's the governor doing that for us. Um, so let's go ahead and ooh, do we have we have three. We, what do we have in reserve? Oh, he's building more freaking survey drones. Why does why does he keep doing that? See, and for some reason I can't make him stop. I okay, that now now you can stop. Um, let's go into Zaggy on here. Do the same. Okay, so these are also not okay. Good, they're not auto auto building um, these things. So that's that's good. We don't want them to do that because that's just gonna get that's gonna get crazy. Uh, but unfortunately, we now have a bunch of survey drones we don't need, so I'm gonna go ahead and scrap them. Uh, Let's see, because for some reason, whenever there's they, they have nothing left to do, they just they just keeps making those. Um, let's go ahead and select, 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 select. No, I don't want to. I don't want all of them. No, no, no. I I just want. They look different. Why is that one long? Oh, first, second. Uh, oh yes, because the for the yes, the st. All right, well, we're gonna keep the first guy. We got three second units. We're now we're gonna go ahead and and just have them scrap. So they're going to go away. There, now. Now they're done. Now we need to get ourselves another planetary engineer. We'll get a couple more. Let's get three, actually. And while we're waiting for those to build, because that's going to take some time, let's go ahead and figure out... Oh, we've scrapped those. We're good there. So here we are in our facilities. We have bunch of sea piers, airfields, and so on. Uh, again, this is all going to be highly well mo modeled like Supreme Ruler style of the entire planet stuff. Um, let's turn off the supply level so we can see more of the grassiness and stuff. Map grid, allies, well, that's all of us. Uh, defensive terrain, ownership is all me. Don't have to worry about diplomatic relations. Okay. I think, I think, yeah, I think we're good. Okay, so these are all the towns. As you can see here, we've got a little village. This one's a little village, a small town, that are kind of built to help uh, with the exploitation of various resources. So this is a little town, this is a little village. What's he, what's he got? What's he got going on? Does he want to, do we want to build some agriculture around there? What can we do? Um, let's see what, what is available. Oh, there's an opportunity for selling energy. It's got uh, favorable selling conditions, but we don't we don't make enough. We don't make enough to really make it uh, doable. So um, let's see. Yes. Okay. So this little village has got some good agricultural zones around it, and a one little metal area, and no energy. So let's go ahead and build a metal mine right there. And then we're going to build an agricultural uh, uh, sector center. Ooh, where'd he go? Over here. Um, let's go ahead and build one right there. That's going to build a complex. Let's go. Let's build that one out completely. And then for this guy, this is the ore guy. Let's go ahead and build him out completely. And you can see all these little these little domes are the little growing domes. And then over here, these are the mines. I can build, I got was have the ability to build four mines. I guess that's the limit of the mining output that that has. But we definitely also need energy. We need energy. Energy, energy, energy. Is there room up here? Well, actually, let's um, let's take a look at energy. No, there's there are no locations ready for expansion. So we're going to have to kind of brute force it a little bit. 
There's a spot there. Is that really the only spot? Shit. Oh, there's two spots. There's one here, the one up there. Uh, let's go ahead and build out as much over there as we can and build over there. So we're going to build, looks like two over there, and I think it's probably two over here as well. Yeah. So we're going to need to build some roads. Build, transport, roads. Oh, come on. How about we do that right? Build, transport, road. Because if I right click, you can see the supply level. And supply is very important for making sure that things get transported around as they're supposed to be and, and so on. I'm pretty sure it, it impacts the availability of what you're producing. But I could be wrong about that, but I, I, I think that's right. I think that's right. Oh, I keep doing, I keep right clicking instead of left clicking when I do that. No, don't want rail. What is this actually? That is transportation infrastructure. It's a road. Okay. It's a road in the plains. You can see down here on the recon tab what, what all that stuff is. So let me uh, let me build a road. Finally get this done. Oh, no, not urban. Damn it. Build. Road. There. Supply is at 39% over there. At this little guy, what are you? You're a sea pier. You've got a little town. You don't have any roads out to you? Hmm. Let's see, how's our finished goods doing? We're actively, we're actively using a little bit more than we were, I think. Maybe we still need some more. Uh, we, uh, let's, let's do it. Oh, nope, nope, nope. Let's, uh... Let's build a road. So what's interesting is rail costs less than roads, um, but I, I don't I don't know what the difference is. Like I don't know why that why you would why it would matter. Uh, what are we uh, industrial complex industrial complex? We've done oh high pressure storage is done. So let's go into the research here. Let's see what else we got. Okay, we've got a few options now. What do we want? Um, quantum data buffers gets us interstellar patrol ships and FTL range, improved engine. Are we already? No, what are we? What are we building here? Neural implants gets us these things. Um, Well, we probably should do the quantum data buffers, which gives us FTL improvements as well. So, and improve construction. Yeah, why not? I mean, it, it's all good. Oop. So yeah, let's uh, let's see about building a road from here to here. Do we want to do it with less goofiness, maybe? Yeah, slightly less goofy looking uh, than this little janky one over here. That's fine. Uh, it's hexes. That's that's why it does that. So. All right. So we are doing a tank chassis, and then we're eventually going to get those done. And we are currently building. I think we're still building. Aren't we building a, a research? Yeah, research center. It's going to take 20, 26 percent. It's going to take another three hundred ninety nine days to build that. Now let's take a look at what we have here for our current units. So we have some light infantry that are deployed. We have a lav and some towed guns. And then we have a bunch of these guys in reserve. So these deployed units, let's go ahead and select them and see where they are. I bet you, yeah, they're all there. They must all be here, right? That's, yeah, that's all, all of them. They're all hanging out here in the in the capital, which makes sense. That, so they're gonna they're defending the capital, but we don't need them just yet. Like it's not it's not critical at this point because we don't have any enemies.
But do we have, we don't have FTL yet, do we? We can find out by going here and look at our known technologies. We do not, right? We do not have the ability to do any of that. Yeah, I mean, I suppose I could just check here. Yeah, we don't have any of the special space designs that come out with when, once we've got FTL. It's coming, it's coming, we'll get there. Let's take a look at Azuno, though, because this is a new little town, little spaceport. We don't have a, a town here, though. We need to get colonies. We need to get colonists out here. I don't know if we can. Can I build a settlement? I can build a settlement out here. Let's build a settlement. Well, let's build it right there, right next, right next door. It's got 38% supply, 44% supply. Uh, let's go ahead and build ourselves a road between the two. There. It says it's an abandoned town. It's building. I'm guessing it's abandoned because there's no colonists here, right? Uh, I, I have not dealt with this yet. I don't really know how it works. Population of 4,000. Okay, so there's some people. There are a few people here. We are building the ore harvester to exploit that asteroid there. All right, so the, our, our, yeah, he's scrapping the toad guns. Yeah, he... He's probably going to be scrapping a bunch of things, because we don't have any enemies at this stage. Except for these pirates, which which are currently boxed up a little bit. We don't... Well, not boxed up so much as just they're not doing anything to us. Uh, let's see, do we have... Yes, there's a planetary engineer. Where are we going to go next? Um, let's go... Down here. Is this a inhabitable? It's hostile. Dense atmosphere. That's not great. I don't know that I want that. Is that all we got? Yeah, they're all up, all up in this corner here. So, let's go to Ubiri. Let's go ahead and uh, put down. Oh, I could also sh control click, control right click here, and build an orbital station so that we can then start exploiting that mine or that asteroid. Here he comes. Ooh, who are these guys? Oh, more interceptors. Let's take a look at these um, these uh, exchanges. So they offered us more finished goods, and we're selling agriculture and ore. And it's finished goods and agriculture and ore again. So let's see what what does the merchant AI know that we don't know? I guess it's really that this is our smallest stock level, is it? It's not. Why are we selling ore? That seems weird. But I guess it's what people want. So we're we're gonna get our we're gonna get our production up. So we want to get um, this to match here kind of, uh, pretty much. We want to get the blue line to match this line. And it is it is going to eventually change. And we can see that the production levels are changing, varying over time. Okay, let's take a look. All right, so these diplomatic exchanges are done. These are good. Orbital station is constructed over here. Now we can see, if I click on this, now we've got another colony over here. So that's this colony, which is different from this colony which is a completely different colony with a completely different governor. I think this is the, this planetary governor is, is overall. So let me see if this, this is different here. It is not. Okay, so this is not really the planetary governor. It's just the overall governor. But on this one, we do have, um, we do have uh, trades that we can do. And over here with this guy, he doesn't have, um, He's going to need, uh, no, we don't need to do it from the governor. He's going to need to have a um, orbital storage. And do we need anything else right now? Do we need a defense platform? Oh, we definitely need an ore harvester. 
and that should be okay for now. Harvester, orbital storage, orbital station. And, and we can't land because there's no surface to view because it's not hospitable. This is non-landable, which is fine. It's a lava planet. So that's done. What's our research breakthrough? That's the ch tank chassis. Advanced neuroscience. This gets us neural implants. This gives us healthcare readings. Alien biology. This does. What does it do? Galactic dynasty. Interesting. Yeah, this is a very, very nice tech tree. That's uh, again, it's again. This game is fairly claustrophobic in terms of how the interface works because I can't see a whole tech tree list like you can in, say, Distant Worlds and most other games. Although, really, you can't see them in Solaris either. So, uh, honestly, it, it, it kind of it's it works out. It's fine. Ooh, more constructions are completed. Ore mines. Oh yeah, these are all the mines and stuff that we built on on um, uh, Zagion. Nice. All right. Let's slow it down a touch. Yeah, it's the finished goods and agriculture and ore trade again. So, if they're taking all of our finished goods, if that's what they really, really want to be getting, um. Or we know that's what we're getting, and what we're selling is ag no wait, what is it again? We're giving finished goods in exchange. Ah, uh, no, dang it. We're getting finished goods. That's right. We're getting finished goods in exchange for agriculture and ore. We need more ore locations because we don't have the best ore. Production. So our production and our actual use, there's a discrepancy here. We've got a stock, but it's dropping. Not super, super fast, but it is dropping. Okay, so let's uh, let's see about building some some more metal uh, ore. So this is no no places that we can expand. So we're gonna have to build new ones. Uh, we're looking for some really nice hot spots where there's at least a little bit of roadway nearby but no and again i don't really know 100 percent if the roadways are required but we, they could certainly be useful down the road if in the military engagement if we need to transport our our guys over oh there i could make bridges oh, oh there we go so what's my supply level here zero percent oh okay that that could be part of oh yes we're gonna let's see what we can do maybe if i build a road here No supply. Oh, I cannot build it in a place where there's no supply. Oh, wow, I boil. Okay. Well, that might be something down the road to worry about. What's what's this here? Oh, that's the building. It's building a bridge. Okay. Uh, well, we'll worry about that later. I'm, I'm getting used to figuring out how the how the supply interacts with stuff. So there's we could do some ore here. What are you? Your agro, or agro, agri, your agri business. There's a nice hot spot for ore, and it's pretty close to the road. Okay, let's go ahead and build. Oh, that's energy. I don't want that. I want this. Yep, I was able to build a full six, right? Yep, full six, and build road. Down to there. All right, let's turn on this. We can see our supply chain information. We're getting 221,000 ore from production to stock, and then from ore to finished goods. Production consumption, we can see who's producing. There's other people who are producing, but we don't know anything about them. Pillagers, which is these guys 
think it's these guys. Whoops. These guys over here. They're consuming stuff. Izuno is consuming finished goods. And so is Ubiri, our, our two, uh, our two colonies. They're also consuming energy from us, and they're also producing energy a little bit. Oh. And or we're producing it. Our colonies are not consuming it. Agriculture. Zuno and Obiri, yeah. Okay. All this is done. That's another power plant. And then imports, imports and exports. We don't know anything yet. We just don't. We don't know anybody yet. So, yeah. Oops. We need to do that. There we go. We've got another planetary engineer. Let's go ahead and let's see. What are we gonna do? Down here. That's non-landable, so let's control, build a orbital station there. I'm not certain that there's much that we can do with this. I'm not sure what we could what we can gain from this place. How do you get ore and energy from a, a planet that you can't land on? I'm not 100 percent sure, but maybe it just will. Find out. We got a bunch of interceptors there. Interceptors are there. And the survey drone and the planetary engineer. There's a survey drone out here. Why is there a survey drone? He doesn't have anything to do. Let's go stick him into reserve. And we probably should build another planetary engineer. Getting a lot of interceptors. Our, our uh, governor is kind of nervous, I think. Nervous about Utera. Oh, yep, very much so. War declared on our region. The pillagers have formally declared war. Dang it! Um, oh boy, that's gonna be that's gonna be a problem. So we need we ah, I should have done this before. No, nope, that's not allowed. Let's go ahead and build a defense platform there. And build ourselves a defense platform here. I'm pretty sure I've already got one on this guy, right? Yes, defense platform. These are really helpful. Uh, all right, so we are at war. Well, crap. How is this going to work? Um, survey drones. We've got some. Uh, yeah, we're going to need. We're going to need a bunch of uh, interceptors. That's all we've got. We don't have anything else. We've got one shipyard. I, I really need another shipyard. Yeah, okay, let's build another shipyard. That's going to take some time, but... We need to have... Oh boy, oh boy, oh boy, oh boy, this is bad. Where are my guys? Where are my guys at? Select all of my units. I'm going to have them come in here to fight that thing. I could set battle groups. This is telling me I can do battle groups. I don't really think I need to do that just now. There, their value levels are dropping. Ooh, research breakthrough. What did we get? Construction logistics. Okay. What did we lose? We lost an interceptor. Damn it. Okay, 
grenades, so these guys are going to take some time getting over to us. That's a... This is a bad thing. I really... really need... I really need some better ships. Hmm... Well, yeah, all right, am I here? Okay, so I, we got him, we got him, we got him, we got him, we got him. Here's the enemy, though, over here, in Uterra. Well, let's see, let's go ahead and, what do I have? I have the survey drones in reserve. What are you doing? You're not doing anything right now. I need to have you go and do something. We build an outpost over there. So that's three interceptors. Yeah, this is uh This is gonna this is this is going a bit cockeyed. Oh, I want this guy to... What do I... Oh. I need him to repair. He's down by, to like half level. The rest of these guys are going... Over there. I wonder if I can set some hotspots. Let's see. So the way hotspots work, if I can remember how to do this. Yes, hotspot there. Set a hotspot. Type of uh, defense or guard. Defense, I think. Yeah, set a hotspot there. Oh shit! There's a raider. Well, it's a good thing I did it. So you you basically you set hotspots of various types, and then the governor will address it. Will kind of do certain things. So, high priority, small force size, balanced mission, I could small, medium, and heavy, you know, small, yeah, so. Oh, but these guys need to come now. Oh, they're killing my defense platform. How are we doing? Come on, come on, guys, come on. Come on, interceptors. There's so many raiders here, and an enforcer. Oh, this is gonna be sucky. And they're not doing bad against that enforcer. Ooh, they're not doing bad at all. These guys are kind of rocking ass, look at that. You can see my interceptors on the selected units list and then they're, with the damage they're doing. did take out my uh, storage. I need a new storage over here. Oh, I don't want to build it yet. Okay, they are killing the raiders. They are annihilating the raiders. Excellent. 
done. What else is happening? Over here. Let's, uh, let's go and build that uh, storage. Oh boy, this is um, it's going to be interesting and a little bit rough. Let's make some more interceptors. There we go. Interstellar ship hulls with advanced computing. I, uh, that's unknown technology. Okay, so that means I should be able to start building other ships soon. Let's see. Base was destroyed. The defense platform was destroyed. Okay, well, we need another one then. What are you? Are you a bad guy? Yes. You are. He's unhappy. And he's dead. Oh boy, and we got more over here again. Well, I'm gonna have to send these guys out here. Defend over there again. Send you down there as well. What are you? Planetary engineer. What can I do with you? Uh, nothing just yet. I'll leave him there. One of these interceptors needs some help. Oh, it's this guy. Well, we're going to have to leave it at this. It's been 33 minutes, and when we come back, uh, hopefully we don't just straight up die. But, you know, we might. Thanks for watching. See you next time.